Anna Winter, I don't think she knows I'm around still, you know. I better tell her. I will survive, sorry Anne. Fashion is 24 hours a day. Basically, I see something, I think about it, you know. So it is a balance, because fashion is very compulsive and it can be dangerous. UK is a very youth-oriented business. And you feel a little bit, you know, should I still be working? I will. <laughs> I'll be annoyed until the end. I still think I'm good as probably most designers in the UK. And I'm not prepared to give that up. Not to any St. Martin's superstar. I'm nice, but I punch. Women's wear is still my passion because it's by far the hardest. And you are putting yourself on the line each season. My wife says I don't like women. I do like women. <laughs> I understand women. And I really would like to think that you see somebody wearing, say, just a hacking jacket, a poor Costello, or a dress, you don't immediately think, and I'm going to get into bed on the first night. It'll at least be three dates <laughs> before she concedes. And that's what I like to retain, that kind of mystery within the female being. Princess Diana was fantastic. She was so warm and unpretentious. It was in the summer and it was pouring rain, typical English summer, and just this great shot of her in my tuxedo suit made in a little factory in Northern Ireland. And um, she just looked amazing. Ugh. She was great. One of those moments in life that you treasure. This collection, it's taken some of the inspiration from last spring, but I've brought it forward into tailoring, into heavy coating, into very rich, luxurious materials. I'm not sure how people will respond. But at least I'm out there showing. There's a tiger in me somewhere that says, no, I'm not going to surrender. I still think I'm quality. God, how arrogant is that? <laughs>